fight, buddy. That's a fight. I'm trying to destroy you, but I'm not gonna lie. Come here. Alright, hi everybody. Welcome back to the stream. I am now playing a Clock Tower 3. I am streaming all year round to raise money for Extra Life. My goal was originally $1,000, but I hit it last night! Yay! Um, so now my goal is to double it. Ah! Before... Ah, my controller fell. Before... I stopped streaming in December with my big 24-hour stream of Deadly Premonition. So... This is very exciting. I didn't think I'd hit my goal this soon. Ah, so Clock Tower 3. I played through Clock Tower uh, SNES uh, and 1 and 2, but I've never completed 3, so this should be interesting. <laughs> yes, I did! I finished that in one go, because it was only um, Chapter 1. There's going to be, I think, three chapters, so it was just a part of the game, so that only took me a little over two hours. So, new game. I thought it was going to be longer as well. I didn't realize it was only part of the game. But I'm, uh, I'm running a little late because I fell asleep on the couch and then woke up one. Oh, shit. Dearest Alyssa. It's eight o'clock. <laughs> I think of you every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life at boarding school. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six years without giving you any explanation. It must have been very painful for you and I'm sorry, but it was for your own protection. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching and I fear your life may be in danger more than ever before. Please, go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please, do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your loving mother, Nancy. This couldn't be said in a Mom. phone call? You had to send Alyssa, a letter? you're wanted on the telephone. It's your mother. Hello? Mum? Hello? Are you there? What's wrong? Answer me. Hello? Hello? Mum? Me. Damn, okay. <laughs> well, so much for hiding on your birthday until it passes. Mom, I'm back. Mom? I know this game gets kind of wild, right? <laughs> I'm excited. It's got to be better than Clock Tower 2. <laughs> That's not your mom, is it? No. Um, excuse me. Are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. That was early yesterday morning. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back. At all. So it's just you. You are all alone in this world now, little girl. Damn. <laughs> My sweet Alyssa. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Get away from me! <laughs> okay. I forgot that they were set in England or something. So, you know, see, at this point, 
with that kind of threat, I would call the police and be like, Hey, this guy told me my mom was never coming back. But you know, that's just me. You know, I tried to leave. Oh, what's this? Oh. We don't need to save right now. Well, the guy said your mom was not coming back, so I think she's dead. <laughs> huh. Why is this highlighted? Okay. Can I drink it? Or okay, so she's been gone for like six years and now her mom is missing before giving her a warning about staying away during her birthday. And she just ignores all of that. <laughs> To come home and act like nothing's wrong. I guess this is her room. My room, nothing's changed. Damn, girl, you have a fireplace in your room? And you got, like, your own little sitting room? Oh, wait, no, this is different. Did I miss something in here? Let's see. Is that okay I, I assume that calms her down just like in haunting around the TV doesn't work well I guess it's time to leave then Damn, this like, r this house is really big. Philip, who's Philip? Is that Grandpa? Okay. I like how they label their bedrooms. <laughs> okay, I'm back in the foyer. Oh, whoa. What is this? Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> you shall not pass. <laughs> A panic meter. Whenever Alyssa is feeling physically or emotionally threatened, the panic meter rises. When the panic meter reaches max, she falls into a state of panic. While in a state of panic, Alyssa's movements are restricted, and if attacked while in a state of panic, she will die. Mm, okay.
That was weird. Okay. <laughs> oh. Whoa, wait. What's that room? The lodgers won't be coming back for a while. Okay, well, where did that other guy go? Uh, I don't know. I guess I'm not surprised con considering this is such a big old house. Wait, how do I get... Oh, oh. There we go. <laughs> oh, bye. <laughs> oh. It looks like a bottle on the letter. Wait, was the bottle in the head? Okay, sacred bottle. Nancy's letter. Dearest Alyssa, I wanted nothing more than for you to live peacefully, but if you're reading this now, you must have come back to the house. For your protection, I am giving you some advice as well as instructions on how to use this bottle of holy water. What? <laughs> okay, Mom. Uh, holy water uses exorcism. If you ever threaten to sprinkle some holy water on your assailant, it will cause him to halt temporarily, destroying sigils. Okay. Sacred jars, lion drinking bottles. The person who's died of unnatural causes has unfinished business in the living world. In order to protect yourself, you must work to heal their wounds. To do so, you must find their sentimental item. Lastly, this is all my fault, but I will do my best to protect you. Please remember, I love you more than anything else in the world, and I always will. Mum. Okay. Thanks, but, you know, maybe if you're honest with your daughter from the get-go, she might have not come back. <laughs> I mean, if if my mom like left me a note with some holy water, it's like, hey, I left this to protect you. I'd be very confused. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm sorry, Whitney, but you're gonna have some uh, ghosts attacking you. You gotta find their sentimental item to put them at rest. Okay. Uh. Oh shit! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I'm going to assume I use it on this. Oh, can I refill it in that water basin in the... Right by the door? Let me see. Oh, let's save. So I vaguely remember she has some annoying little friend that pops up and I remember going back in time with a girl playing the piano and that's pretty much all I remember about this game. <laughs> oh. Okay. 
I guess I can't can't use the restroom. Can I use the Oh. Nancy. Can we unfold it? No. Okay. I came back home. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mum? Hey. Oh. Oh, hey, it's the lodger. <laughs> Someone so freaked out about a piano before. <laughs> uh, my golden badge? Oh, are you talking about extra life? Oh, thank you. Exciting. I didn't. Uh, I was very excited to reach the 1k goal so fast. Well, not, I mean, it took me a while, but I mean, I thought I wouldn't get it until the end of the year.
Yeah. Give me back my ring. Can I hear that? When you find a sentimental item that belongs to a person who died of unnatural causes, return it to the rightful owner. If it's a ring, put it in its case. If it's a half-heart pendant, put it together with the other half. By returning these sentimental items, spirits are healed, and Alyssa may attain another item or valuable information in return. Okay. Oh my god, I'm trying to give you back your ring, dude. Oh my god, I better not die, like, right from the get-go. <laughs> Hold on. How do I... a little bit more than burned like half of his head is gone okay. oh can I refill my holy water oh it's so much okay uh sorry i'm catching up on the yes tw uh deadly premonition is going to be for the 24 hour stream yeah that game's really long so uh so that one should be a lot of fun i'm hoping maybe i could get like um guests on as well like like cj um other people from Lion on horror um i also want to give away prizes like deadly premonition themed prizes so people would be uh would donate as well like for people who donate a certain amount they'll be put into a raffle for for something deadly premonition related uh, i'm still in the planning stages right now but we'll see i'm really excited Uh, Frau Frau, did you have to work tomorrow or will you be able to stay uh, tonight? Because it's a weekend. off the uh, cliff. Oh, she can't. Alright. Let's use our holy water. Oh, no, wrong button. Oh, and I do vaguely remember her, like, becoming a magical girl or something to kill the serial killer. I know it gets weird. <laughs> Though I think the story is probably a little bit more coherent in this one versus Clock Tower 1 where things just happen randomly with no explanation. Uh-oh. 
my darling. Okay. Must be her item. Oh. Okay. Let go. -ho. I do kind of find it a little amusing that all of the uh, people who die are in these flowing robes and stuff. Okay, what is this? Oh, okay. Well, we'll, we'll wait to use that. What does it say? Dead? Dead set trust? Get out of... I can't read that last word. Okay. Why did the piano just stop? That's kind of ominous. Oh, never mind. <laughs> the person was on a break. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you have a, a game to get to. Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Okay. Cool. Oh, no, no, no. Alrighty. Clothing store. Are you not comfortably warm? You're the one that wanted to be in my lap. Ugh. Sorry, I'm trying to play a game at the moment. Um, you've nothing to say about the. Br okay. there's a chase sequence coming up. <laughs> Dad's letter. Dear May, how are you? I'm now in France, in a region known as Champagne. It's a beautiful place with vineyards as far as I can see. When the war is over, we must come together for a holiday. I hear that they have organized for blackouts in London now. I am sure you're fine during the day as Jane is there, but I worry about you being alone at night. You'll be all right, won't you, darling? Keep warm of love, Daddy. A tree with decorations. Today must be Christmas Day. 
not necessarily. You know, some people put their trees up a couple of weeks before Christmas. <laughs> Christmas tragedy, blah blah blah. Christmas tragedy: young pr pianist brutally murdered. Christmas Day, 1942. Paul Mall, May Norton, age 12, was found murdered in Norton's The Tailor. She was discovered by Norton family nanny Jane Stride, who returned home to find the victim unconscious, ble bleeding from the head. An autopsy re has revealed that it was an instantaneous death caused by a blow to the skull with a heavy blunt object. No suspects have been named. The victim had taken part in the 15th annual piano concourse at Victoria Hall in Kensington the previous day. A consummate pianist, Miss Norton, was widely tipped for first prize, but an unfortunate error in her performance prevented her from taking the crown. May had been living at home alone since her father, William Norton, a serving officer, returned to the front in July. Oh. Wow, that was Alisa. not good. Wait, you know my name? Vade point and high points. Okay. This is fleeing from enemies who are predetermined areas by search below. These are evade points and high points. Approach the area and press the search button to make elicited amazing actions or propel an attack. Note that most evade points can only be used once. Press the search button when in front of a high point and Alyssa can take refuge there. Okay. Alrighty. Alright, so... I didn't think that going in here would start the chase. Maybe I should have checked out that sigil room first. Oh well. Ah! Oh, you couldn't have busted open that filing cabinet? Oh my god! Oh my god, Alyssa, run faster! <laughs> yes, just take your time. Oh shit, I can't hide now. Right? I didn't think I could. I wasn't sure. <laughs> Huey, where are you? I need you. <laughs> My darling. Oh, 
Oh shit, am I trapped? Oh no! Yeah, this is different. There's no, like, main scissor man dude. It's like a bunch of different serial killers. Thank you. All right, let's check out that sigil room I skipped over. <laughs> oh, wait, is this a door? No. Must be the owner of the house. Hmm, there's a key next to it. Oh, can I open up the. Yep, alrighty. Let's open up that drawer. Oh, this would have been an evade item, I assume. say when I when they're like the little girl got murdered that was not who I pictured to be the murderer some random mass dude with a giant hammer room key. Okay. Why would that be locked in the uh, in the red drawer? That's kind of weird. Okay, you want to get down? Alright, here you go. Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, no! Thank <laughs> you. 
Bye, dude. Oh, nice! Did you like it? Did you buy it for um for Switch or did you buy it for something else? Oh shit, I didn't mean- oh man, I thought there was a map button. Select is the map button. Nope. Which is the button for the map? Select button map. Okay. <sighs> no, that's where she died. Where am I on this map? Okay, that's the dad's room. Oh, there's a door there. Okay, okay, okay. Ah. What's with Capcom and not like placing a marker where your character actually is on your map? Okay. Did you see the original or the uh, director's cut cover? Because the original's cover is like, what? <laughs> Very strange. May's Diary. December 5th. Today I darned daddy's socks and sewed a button on his shirt. He calls himself a tailor, but he can't even mend his own clothes. Please, Daddy, I'm not your wife. <laughs> okay. Um, 15th of December, only a few more days until the concourse. I still can't play it perfectly. What am I to do? I know Daddy's wishing me well from far away, so I must try my very best. Don't worry, Daddy, I'll make you proud. Alright. Okay. Dude. Alisa. <coughs> oh, <man. coughs> sorry about that. I just had a sip of tea. Man, that went down the wrong way. Okay. Alright. What do I do? I don't know. Uh, but we'll figure it out. Alisa! Get your bitch! <laughs> get the map. Okay. Cool. Uh, 
All right, let's go to the piano competition. Alyssa. Alyssa. <laughs> I assume it probably does, given it's a Capcom game. So I bet there's like special costumes or something. Oh, bye. <laughs> he just leaves. Oh, I just went in a circle. All right, time to play in front of an audience, Alyssa. I hope you're prepared. Okay, I'm sorry. I know it's like it's supposed to be dramatic, but this guy just coming out of nowhere. <laughs> I need to find some weird hide. Oh, fudge. Oh. Oh, Jesus.
safe combination bad. 10, 14, babe, 34, 03 equal dead. Okay, so is it 103? Alyssa, where are you? Wait, can you not see me? You're mine now. took off that little? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> oh, my god, shit. Uh, I need to hide. Something. Where Alice, am I supposed to go? Uh, where are you? Three or something. One oh three. Okay. Master key. So thoughts, uh, are you liking playing through Deadly Premonition or are you running into problems with the PS3 version? Because I forgot how laggy that one is. Ugh. Oh, there's a key. Okay, so I need to go back to the main concert hall. It's nice that the game marks where the locked doors are. Cool. Did you get all the way through it or are you still playing playing through it? Yeah, there's, there's so many great details in that game. <clears throat> I'm just so happy you're checking it out. <laughs> I want everybody to play the game. Oh, wow. Oh, this is where the dead body came from. Oh, shoot. I gotta raise that back up.
was she trying to express? Probably her sorrow of being killed. Bet you that was the piece she played uh, in the concert that she messed up. Keep all stage devices raised at all times. <laughs> My bad. Sorry, management. I'm supposed to find, I guess, something to put her at rest. I'm not sure what I'm looking for, though. Alright, I guess I need matches or something. Ah! That did startle me. Where the hell did you come from? Where is it going to put me? Oh. Uh -uh. Okay. <coughs> well, at least I know to check out the other room first. So let's raise the... Yeah, it seems so. Though, 
Fiona didn't die automatically if she got hit once in panic mode, so... This seems a little bit harder. And we don't have a dog to attack for us. No, like, when she's in panic mode, she'd run. And she'd keep running, like, into things. But you had a couple chances to still get away. This seems like... You get one hit, you're, you're gone. So yeah, of course she, she could still die, but it didn't seem as quick as this one. Oh my gosh, I can't die already. What? That is not fair! For a moment, I got in there too late. Oh yes, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> I completely forgot about the save states. Let's let's do that. I kind of got out of that mindset because I was playing the other game last night that did not have save states. Match is nice. Okay. Now I can light that lantern. Alright, let's make our way back. Why is it getting dark? Oh, oh no. Oh shit. You're mine now. Wait, he was in this room? to go around the piano in here. Well, 
Oh no, he's there. Um. Where is that door? This is special circumstances, Alyssa. I think you can go through it. Okay, there must be a... I can't believe I'm already stuck. Where do I get out of this place? Oh! Oh, do I crawl? Is that it? There we go! Oh! Alright. I like how she's not freaked out that she's gone back in time. And that the serial killer dude knows her name. Dude! I died and I didn't pick it up. Again, that's a that's what happened. Can I do something? Okay. Nope. Honestly, this one doesn't seem to have much of a connection to the first one. At least that I can see so far. So this is a brand new game. I'm just as confused as you are right now. I, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> All we know so far is her mom said not to come back on her birthday and then she got a call from her mom, she wasn't there, and she decided to go back home anyway. And her mom is probably dead. And there's a creepy dude. Staying in her house.
All right, so I guess I use the pliers for the barbed wire in the house, maybe? Oh, come on. She kind of looks like she's wearing Crocs. Alyssa got, has more balls than I do. I don't think I would be able to do this. Ugh. Walk across a plank on a... I like not having to do the point click stuff. Stab him again! Um... Alright, well... Hope she got him in the eye. She's, uh, living in an internship? Yeah. A letter telling her not to come back home. <laughs> She's like, Welp, <laughs> I'm gonna ignore that advice. Uh, wait. Why do I?
Yep, that's what it said in the opening. And she went, I do what I want, and came home anyway. Tell you something important. Daddy's going off to war. War? I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone. I feel dreadful. I'll be all right. But, but what about you? You'll miss me and be sad when you're in war, won't you? Yes, yes, I will. You're the most precious thing to me in the whole world. But don't worry. Daddy, don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve. The winner will have their performance aired on the radio. I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. That will be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. I'll practice every day. I've already chosen the piece I'm going to play. Listen. You told me this watch was a present from Mummy before you got married, remember? I'll play this tune on Christmas Eve, so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again. Is that the dad? Aww. Okay, now we know why she messed up on her piano. She probably got news that her dad died. Hammer killer hanged. 10th of September, 1941, Robert Morris, 32, the man known as the Hammer Killer, has been hanged. Rumors regarding Morris's death are widespread. One witness reported he was hanging for a very long time, pulling on the straps and making unearthly noises, and blood was oozing through the black cap. The stench was terrible. Some witnesses fainted and were carried out. Morris's first victim was Tony Flanagan, 35, a fellow employee at the Banbury Stone Cutting Factory. On June 6, 1940, Morris suddenly struck Flanagan on the head with a hammer, killing him instantly. All five workers present were killed in the same manner. Morris disappeared thereafter. A string of similar crimes occurred until the time of Morris's arrest on the 6th of March in Arlington, Ham Hampshire. Hampshire, or Hampshire, I don't know. Morris's victims numbered 12, and no clear motive has been determined. Specialists continue to be baffled by the seemingly abrupt change in his behavior, as well as the extreme violence of his crimes. Wait, so... If that's when he was hanged, how... How did he come back to kill the little girl on Christmas in 42? I mean, this is 1942, right? Okay. Let's go save the little girl.
Yeah, 42. Okay. Oh, no, I'll save me. Got to call. I should have saved. <laughs> All right. Shoot arrow. Super attack. Great, this kind of sounds complicated. <laughs> Let's uh, do a quick save here. Oh, magical girl time. Yeah, this is really weird. <laughs> uh, you thought this was a horror game, but no, we are Sailor Moon. Victims 26. Sentence to 486 years. Judgment! Oh shit! So, I need to...
Can I not access my... Love sucks. Make sure to do a quick save after this. We get to see the transformation one more time. hands on it and try it out. I don't think 
talking will let me a dodge that. R1 is special arrows. Okay, let me I'll try doing the R1. Special arrows. boss is not voting well for the rest of the game. <laughs> there must be something I'm missing here. Okay, hold on a second. I am going to look up There must be something I'm missing in the controls. I guess will save me from Oh, thank you. Oh, did you post something else? Because I just see it but by using the above strategy. Hold it 
a really long time and then do the chain thing. Some dude is when he starts charging his attack. Oh. oh, I didn't crouch. Shoot. Do it? Nice! What is going on? <laughs> I, went, I just did a, like a, a spirit bomb attack on you. Nice! <laughs> All right! This is kind of awesome. Why did I stop playing this back in the day? Because <laughs> I know I got at least this far. Okay. So combat's a little awkward with the whole not aiming thing, but I, I think I get it. Clover of Love. All right, yay! Oh, now I can get up to four holy waters? Or is it always four? I thought it was three before. I mean, this, now this is leagues better than Clock Tower 2. <laughs> I like the protagonist a lot more, and the story is a lot more interesting, even if it's a little uh, kooky. A shell. I'm so sorry. Please don't cry. I understand how you feel. I never even knew my father. I lost him soon after I was born. But I love my grandfather just the way you love your father. Keep this watch as a memento of your father and continue to practice the piano as hard as you can. You know that would make him happy. Yeah, and you could join him in the afterlife. May. May. Daddy! Aw. Yay! Thank you, May. Your beautiful playing has brought me back to you. At last, we can be together again. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank Aww. you. Thank you. Goodbye, Meg. Goodbye, Mr. Norton. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, that's a little awkward. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Hmm. Yay! Oh, whoa. Okay. <laughs> oh, you could play this? Nice. Oh, it's a dream. Okay. That was a weird dream. Killed Zero Killer with your Sailor Moon magic. Have I been dreaming? Oh, Jesus! What are you doing here? For sure. Long time no see, Alyssa. What the fuck? I haven't seen you since we were in primary school together. It must be three years. What do you think you're doing entering a lady's residence through a window? I have to give you something. Ah, here it is. It's the key to my grandfather's room. Mother always had this key with her. What are you doing with it? You saw her? When and where? Calm down, calm down. What the it was fuck yesterday is with morning this scene? and your mother drove by in her car. Oh, and she said you might come back from boarding school and ask me to hand that key to you if she wasn't back in time. She must have known I'd disobey her and come back here. She must have gone up to meet me. We just missed each other. Hey, Alyssa, you've really changed since I last Why saw is he always moving? What the room. fuck, dude? Hey. Calm down. Well... It looks like you've grown up too, Dennis. What the oh, fuck? Come on. That was then and this is now. Wait a minute, would you? What is what are you doing? What is that? <laughs> oh my goodness. The guy is so weird. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I know, right? Oh my goodness. <laughs> he does look like Ron Weasley. <laughs> okay. Wait. Is he just still in her room? Oh, where'd he go? Okay. Well, where's grandfather's room? Okay, I don't know. Let's, uh... <sighs> yes, I would like to see the footage, because that whole scene was really awkward to watch in video game format. I can't imagine watching some adults <laughs> do this in real life. Uh, let's see. Oh, no. Nope. Can I open this now? Hell yeah! Now we can use the bathroom! Oh shit! What the hell? Oh my goodness! Why are you so angry? I just wanna pee! Oh my god! Dead body in here. Well, I hope that's not your mom. Alright. Well, I guess I shouldn't have opened that door.
Wait, what? There's another painting stuck under the first one. There's a clock. Okay, and two little trinket things. Special winding keys. What did I pick up in the war? Oh, okay. Where's Grandpa's room? Oh, wait. What? Oops. What is this on the side? So I assume I'm going to um, confront three more killers, maybe? Oh man, I didn't need to do that. Oh well. Oh boy. Okay. Look, I'm sorry, ghost lady. Oh, she can't follow me. Uh, let's go back downstairs, I guess. I can refill my holy water. Oops. What? I think there's plenty of reason to go outside. Probably that, uh, lodger dude who was creepy. Use Dick's room key, yes. Hey, Grandpa, you're around. All these old books. What was he studying? Is that a... Is that like a pharaoh bust or something? Oh, wow. Looks like he is some sort of archaeologist or something. Mask used to hang here. The keys to the mystery of time lie behind you. What could that mean? There are some old books to one side. The Book of Entities 1 Entities have existed in the human realm since Roman days. These beings have been known to possess innocent humans, imbuing them with utter ruthlessness and cruelty, and often driving the possessed victim to possess to vicious acts of murder. In such cases, executing the murderer does not break the circle of evil. The possessed is resurrected to continue its bloodthirsty mission. Oh, okay. So it looks like that hammer guy got possessed by an entity. Those who are thus controlled by entities are known as subordinates. When a subordinate kills a human, they take nourishment from the victim's soul, and their power grows. Subordinates may acquire an infinite amount of power in this manner. It follows, then, that subordinates are sustained by human misery and suffering. Only certain humans are equipped to fight entities and their subordinates. The rooters... Okay. Rooters who are always young, women in their teens, have been battling against these shadowy enemies for hundreds of years. Their war is likely to continue for many centuries to come. Do they stop being a rooter when they become a 20-year-old? Huh. 
entities? Rudus. Why is Teenage it spelled girls with who stand okay. against the forces of darkness? What, did you find anything? Oh in my there, god, Alyssa? dude. <laughs> What's that? Entity. What's an entity? And the Ruders? <coughs> so it wasn't a dream. I'm going to look for my mother. You want to look for your mother? But she was in a car, remember? She could be anywhere by now. She's nearby. I can tell. Wouldn't she come back mean? to the house? It doesn't matter. Just go home. Let me help you. Just the two of us. It'll be like the old days. Oh, my God. That was a long time ago. Well, I might as well help you. There's, there's nothing to do at home. I'm alone in the house until my sister comes back anyway. You mean Linda? Isn't she travelling? Yeah. She's working as a nurse at a refugee camp in Africa. In her last letter, she said she won't be back for at least another six months, so I'm free to babysit, walk dogs, look for missing mothers. Okay. You can check upstairs while I look downstairs. Yes, boss. Hey, one more thing. Isn't it your birthday tomorrow? Huh? My birthday? See, even after all this time, I still remember. Yay? What's the matter? Oh, nothing. Now check upstairs, will you? You can count on me, partner. Was that supposed to be American? <laughs> that guy is very, really weird. His movements, it's very spastic. Ah. <laughs> uh... Okay. Is this the grandpa? There's something hidden behind the picture frame. Oh, nice! Cool, got the keys. Alright. Uh, let's go back to that clock. Gotta have to look around for them some more, but... Oh, I should probably check over here. To the left, too. Oh, I think it's locked. Never mind. Yeah. Alright. Let's go back to, uh... Tom's room. You're just gonna chill there the entire time, Mr. Ghost, or Mrs. Ghost? Uh, alrighty, so what is it? So three o'clock, and... This is annoying. Oh no. So that, tr that makes it go half an hour.
Oh. Oh, damn it, it's on 2 o'clock. Oh, I'm so happy for a second. Uh. Thank you. Oh, whew. What a pain in the ass clock. Okay, I just need to set the time forward an hour for for uh, daylight savings. God damn it! Wow, this is a interesting room. All red. Portal squares. Drawing the portal square as instructed is only the beginning. Remember, the portal square must be thoroughly purified with holy water until it has been sufficiently charged with energy for full effect. Only when the square is infused with light may the practitioner expect any groundbreaking results. Okay. Witchcraft and hexes. Looks like your grandpa was into the occult. Oh, your mom is doing shit. Okay. Um. Well, I guess now we know why they have holy water just in their house. How did she... Okay, so I guess the first time was just kind of a fluke if you need to do this sort of shit. To travel Wrong button. Still wrong button. Ghost Town. Okay. I can't pick it up? No! Ah! <laughs> OK. 
Okay, I guess... Oh! Oh, there's another ghost over there! Okay, maybe the teddy bear belongs to this ghost. Oh, my goodness! Oh, here we go. Oh, good thing I quick saved. Okay. Oh, they're blind. Who are you? What are you doing here? something. Mama. Okay. Let's continue uh, searching the house then. The mom. Where on earth have you got to? I've been waiting for you, waiting and waiting. He's in the hallway, dude. I'm surprised you didn't hear him screaming at me. much um okay hey I found your mom Albert No, no. Lady, I just want to help. Oh, oh my god. She's like really panicking. Diary. The 13th of November, Percy from the bakery gave me the name of a good optometrist in London. It's been seven years now since Mum lost her sight, and though she tries to appear cheerful, it's difficult to watch her grow old. Perhaps a doctor can do something to help her. It will be expensive. I wonder if my savings will be enough. Wait, we're going to three days later. 
Yesterday, a relative of ours, name of John Han, Han, Ha, Ha, I don't know, came asking if he could stay with us. He was very cordial, but I can't help thinking there's something calculated about him. I said as much to Mother, who scolded me for judging a book by its cover. I suppose she's right. Blood is thicker than water, as they say. 21st of November. I have been hearing strange noises late at night for the last three days or so. I hear that a team of burglars have been striking homes in the area. I must remember to lock all the doors and windows at night. This is the past. It it seems like it is. I don't know if it's 42, but it doesn't seem modern. Considering the guy has like a bell and stuff. He doesn't have like a modern uh, blind person's uh, stick. Up shit. Okay, kitchen key. No! Oh, ah, just ran right into her. No! Oh, yay! We can go help that other ghost. Back in her home, I assume that's the, uh... Let go of me! We're back in modern times, and whenever she goes back, uh, to sleep or does the sigil thingy, she's going to the past to, uh... Where's the kitchen? Okay, I guess it's over there. Oh my gosh, let go! person is dead in their kitchen. <laughs> Found very important clue to Rand's murder. We'll go back to the house to investigate and gather info. Got a feeling about this. It will be the biggest scoop in Fleet Street. Newspaper clipping, a sandwich. Okay. Serial killer high meets grizzly end. Oh, looks like their relative is a serial killer. Oh, okay, we're in the 60s. All right. In May 1962, West Sussex, uh, John High, the serial killer on the run since early last year, has been excuse me, found dead at a metal plating works. High is responsible for the cold-blooded murder of several pe pensioners whom he robbed before placing the bodies in a container of sulfuric acid thus disposing of the evidence. The acid used in the crimes was stolen, leading the police to a place to place factories wait, leading the police to place factories in the area with stocks of sulfuric acid under surveillance. The suspect appeared at a plating factory in Horsham and a struggle ensued. 
Kai lost his balance and fell from a platform into a vat of acid, ironically meeting the same end as his victims. I'm not looking forward to battling this dude if he's going to be throwing acid at me. Oh! Oh, is this the ghost from outside that's chasing me? Yay. All right. to hell? Oh, Freddy? No. Ready? Oh, oh, oh. Ready to go? Oh. Oh, set. Set. Set to go to hell. Ready? Ready, set to go to hell. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I don't know why that was so hard for me to Read. Oh, I'll go refill my holy water. Oh, who's that? Is that your mom? Oh, it is! Mom? Oh no, does that mean your mom is dead? means I should go back to the house? Can I do that? Let's see. Kill our friend. Ah. <laughs> right, where was my grandpa's room? Was it downstairs?
mask in there too. Book of Entities 2. In order to de defeat a subordinate, the murdered soul, which acts as its energy source, must be healed. To instigate the healing process, a sentimental item belonging to that person must be obtained. Yeah, I got that. And uh, if and when this item has been found, their ruder power is boosted temporarily. The ruder portal square appears, and within is found the sacred weapon necessary to vanquish the subordinate. Okay, thanks, Mom, but I, I kind of already figured that out on my own. Strange mask. Okay, let's hang that up. Oh, I'm fine. God, I don't have to use items. Back. Man, there's secret rooms galore in this house. battle the entities are scattered all over Europe. We, the Hamiltons, are also of ruder stock. Of this lineage I am proud. The ruder blood is passed down to females. My wife, Francesca, was a ruder. In my naive youth, I did not believe any of it. I denied the presence of entities and ruders alike, preferring to believe that it was all just an old wives' tale. But then I found the Book of Entities, and Nancy began to sharpen her ruder powers. I finally opened my eyes to the truth and began my research into the subject. The ruder powers first appear in a young woman's early teens and peak at age 15. The powers then gradually diminish, usually disappearing entirely by the age of 20. For generations, the women of the Hamilton clan have spent their teens fighting against subordinates for the ruder cause, before marrying in their 20s in order to produce the next generation of ruders. Nancy is already 18. Her ruder powers are dwindling rapidly, and it is almost time for her to pass the job on to the next female. We Hamiltons think of our ruder blood as something of which to be proud, as well as a responsibility that must be taken very seriously. I am sad to give my beloved Nancy to another man, but it must be done. I will watch her marry with a broken heart. Another ruder has been born to the Hamilton household, my first grandchild. I chose for her the name Alyssa. She is bright and lively, perhaps even a little strong-willed, and yet appears somehow wise beyond her years. I pray she will grow strong and healthy, and will fulfill her obligation as a noble ruder. Uh, why did you name her? Why didn't her mom name her? A ruder family. So, I am a ruder. It's in my blood. Leave it to me, Grandpa. I have the same ruder strain in my blood as my mother. I can save Dorothy and Albert. Then and only then will I be able to leave this nightmare and see my mum again. I'm sure that's the way, isn't it? But it's a little strange that, okay, if her mom did this as a teen, why was she trying to tell her not to come back? Wouldn't she want her to do her job as a ruder? So there must be something else going on as well.
Also, what happens if, if the woman with the power doesn't get married and have a kid? Does, are they forced to have a child? <laughs> you must get married and pass on the powers! Alrighty, so I guess I'm now going back to the past. So... Oh, wrong way. Yeah, well that's when our powers are peak. That secret room's over there. Oh, my bad. <sighs> so maybe mom knew that she'd have to start fighting things as soon as she got home. <laughs> and it's like, hey, come back when your power is at full strength. Oh my goodness, lady. I'm sorry you died. It's not my fault. be it. Alright, so let's go help these mom and son. Now that I know my mission. So the blind, uh, the mom and the son got killed by their relative. Oh, <laughs> so we need to find that relative guy, I guess, possessed by the entity and get rid of him to help put them at peace, I assume. I don't know. It's a really strange name. They spelled it as R-U- um, R-U-D-E-R, uh, but they spell it ruder, like rue in the uh, subtitles, which is a little strange. Oh wait, okay, there's nothing in here then? Can't go. Well, maybe I can go in there. Let's see. <laughs> oh, no, it's the exit. Oh, wait, it was at the exit. Try spelling it with the U instead of the, the two O's. <laughs> oh, I just went in a big fat circle. Great job. Uh, 
Okay, I got silly. Can I give it to this guy here? Ah! Hmm. Oh, damn. He's like right there taking photos. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Can't really see the suspect in it. I wonder if the person who took the photograph at. Yeah, he's, he's right there at your feet. <laughs> Open door with a hidden switch. Oh, the painting, okay. Alrighty, so gotta find a door next to a painting. gonna run into the, uh, the serial killer guy. I assume I'm gonna run into him soon. Oh, this must be uh, a journalist's place. Sodium chlorate sounds flammable. Mother, what are you doing? I told you, you shouldn't wander around outside by yourself. I came to tell you that dinner's ready. And I told you that you don't need to be worried about me. Your old mother may have dicky eyes, but she's not on her last legs yet. You just concentrate on your work. Anyway, what is it you're making this time? Some new toy that'll have the local kids a gog, I bet. Actually, I've been busy making this. Aww... Albert, what's this? Winter's coming, and I don't want you catching cold, wandering around outside. I've been making this in my spare time. How is it, warm enough? It's lovely. So warm and soft. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's enough play, happy family. You make me Oh my sick. gosh. <laughs> Oh my god, dude! Oh my god, jeez, super violent! Oh my god! Okay, well, I guess we're throwing this. Wait, 
I saw something glowing in there. Well, we gotta go back. We gotta go back. Sorry. <laughs> Well, that was very violent. <laughs> oh. They were having a moment. He's just like, fuck that moment. Time to die. Okay, the thing dropped over here. Can I... Pick that up. Oh, toolbox, okay. Um. Well, I have to find the item before she can transform. But, wow. I can see why that scene... <laughs> ...was a bad one. Okay. So I guess head back to the toolbox? Oh shit! Not expected to be that. <laughs> oh, 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 whoa, whoa. Oh, man. Uh, let's wear this. Yes. Oh wow, that really <laughs> is simple. Ah! You climb the stairs fast. Yeah, only for boss fights. Yeah, take your time. Not like you have a killer after you. She dies, dies pretty. Alrighty, so I guess I'll need this probably to get the, the shawl from wherever it went in the uh, drain. So... There she is! <laughs> Bitch, please! Oh. Great, now I can see. Alrighty. There she is. Uh, oh my what? Wait, how did you get in front of me? You're behind me. 
no! Back off, dude. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Use a tool. There she is! Oh man! See an open area? I guess this is where I'm gonna probably fight the guy. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, I threw um I threw holy water at him. I got it. I only have one left. I have to fill it back up. This was a hiding spot, but I guess not. Alrighty, let's see if I can get that shawl. Whoa, lady, leave me alone. Okay, I guess I can't go that. I can't believe there's a freaking sewer level in this. Shouldn't be surprised. Survival horror game. There must be a sewer level. to happen. Oh, I guess not. Oh no. Oh, maybe it was. Didn't drown there then. He got burned alive by that dude. The acid. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm not going that way. Why did you stop walking? I found you! <laughs> ah, no! Let's, uh... Uh... I want to use the ring. Okay, I'm guessing I'm using this. Magical girl time. <laughs> She's doing a little bit of like parkour there. Ha 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 ha! 
There she is! Prepare to die! How do I switch to my repellent there? I'm hitting on... Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button, that's why. There she is! Oh no, so close. No. There she is. Prepare to die. There she is. Is that a PC game? There she is! Damn it! 
There she is!
prepare to die! Use like my room and stuff. Running for days. Damage. No, no, that's not fair. <laughs> Why'd you move? I was all charged. Man, these battles are really long. 
I must be doing something wrong. There she is. No, I cannot. Or if I can, I don't know where how to do it. I've hit like there every she button. Is. There she is. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up. One action. I just have to hold down the uh, triangle. Damage! 
she is. Prepare to die!
Yeah. I don't know if it's like three, but because I got three. God. Cause it looked like I got him three times and he was still not. God, that guy was super hard. <laughs> oh. Like trying just to get him three ah! times. Understand why he can't move for A, but maybe that's the way to make it harder. I don't know. Yay! Yep. Okay, now let's go. I guess get the shawl back. So long for you. Remember this? It's the winter shawl you knitted for me. Mother, I can see. I can see too. Yay! Bye! Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you very much. Dorothy, Albert, goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. 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 Okay, that looked a little bit less. Oh, whoa, what's going on? <laughs> Quite a feat destroying two subordinates. The ruder strain appears especially strong within you, Alyssa. Okay. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>, save. <laughs> Underground cave? I'm in the house still. Whoa! Very strategically not seeing her panties, that's great. Oh. 
Now we see where the clock tower comes in. Wait, why are you excited? This is still scary. Alicia, this is no longer your home. This is the dark realm where I rule. In two hours, the clock will strike midnight, and your 15th birthday will arrive. When that happens, you and I will become one, and together what? we will obtain eternal life. My... my 15th birthday? Are you looking forward to it? No. So am I, my dear. No, I'm so not. Am I. I can't wait. Soon we two will be united forever. Ew! Alicia, Ew! You might have defeated two of our number, but your mother was killed by a subordinate long ago. <gasps> no! No! She can't! If you don't believe me, you can go to hell and see for yourself! <laughs> What's with Capcom and these, like, hiding games and the dude wanting to have sex with the protagonist? for immortality. You had that in Haunting Ground, now this one. Though I guess, well, Clock Tower 1 was in Capcom, but uh, that dude wanted to have sex with the protagonist too. Oh my goodness. I think I'm gonna stop it here for now because I'm kind of tired. So I will continue this uh, tomorrow, probably at nine o'clock. I don't know if I can start at eight tomorrow, but yeah, this is interesting. <laughs> it's goofy and terrifying at times. Oh man, that death scene was really bad. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. It was a blast. Um, I will try to get this uploaded. YouTube's being a butt today. I couldn't get my stream last night uploaded, uh, but fingers crossed I can get these uploaded. So you guys have a great day tomorrow and I'll speak to you all again tomorrow night. Good night. Bye.